Hello guys, welcome back to another video on Make Now Tech. And in this video, we're going to see how we can change the WhatsApp ticks and then WhatsApp name which appears in the action bar of WhatsApp. So with that being said, let's get started. So in the previous tutorial, we saw how we change the incoming and outgoing bubbles color. And in today's tutorial, we're going to see how we can change the WhatsApp ticks. That is like this. Uh, the ticks have already uh, have some of them over here. We will just replace them so i've give you a, a view of this uh, so this both the ticks are when the receiver receives and reads the message this the gray one over here is when we send the message to the is when we send the message and the green ticks are for uh, is when the message is received but not read so we'll replace that and we will also change the name of the whatsapp over here the whatsapp name which is appearing over here in this action bar will change that also so first we'll change the text over here we will just copy all of the uh, just press ctrl a and we will copy all of them and now just go to the decompile apk section then go to whatsapp then go to res then go to drawable hdpi v4 the folder we are in which we change the incoming and outgoing bubbles you have to go there and just paste it over here and you will see option that the destination has six files with the same names okay we will replace them and as you can see the file has been replaced the text has been replaced do the same with the drawable x hdpi v4 and we will paste the text over here also okay we will replace all of them so it has been replaced and do the same thing with the drawable x hdpi do the same with the folder drawable x x hdpi v4 so we'll paste it here also okay we will replace all these files and as you can see it has now been replaced so and for now changing the name of the whatsapp in the action bar just go to res then just scroll down and go to this values folder over here and then go to strings uh, then go to the strings.xml file over here and open it with notepad plus plus and now search for the line uh, for uh, finding a line just press ctrl f on your keyboard and search for this line uh, in the find what section just type this double quotation app underscore name close the double quotation marks arrow and type whatsapp the w should be in the uppercase and just find and it will locate the name directly so we will change the whatsapp name over here just delete this whatsapp line over here and we will add our own we will add like make now okay and then just press this save button over here okay so now we have changed the whatsapp ticks and the name in the action bar also and now we will compile the apk so just open up android multi-tool and then just locate the whatsapp apk and click on the compile button so the compilation will take some time okay so now we have finished the compilation and we have faced no errors over here and now we will sign the apk the signing of the apk will not take that much time so just go to the compiled folder compiled apk folder then go to whatsapp folder then click on this whatsapp apk and click on open and we will sign this apk the signing will not take that much time Okay, so now the signing has been finished and we have faced no errors over here also. So now we will transfer this signed APK onto our mobile phone. So we will just move this to our mobile phone. Okay, so now we will paste the uh, signed APK over here. 
and now we will install the apk okay so we'll now installing the apk okay so now it is installed and we will open it and as you can see over here the action bar which you had whatsapp written it it's now make now and now we will see the ticks over here the ticks we have applied so now as you can see the whatsapp ticks over here the blue one over here which is that uh, when we have read it and here is the gray one that means it has not been read yet so guys that's it for this video if you like this video do hit a like button for more videos like this do subscribe to my channel and thank you for watching see you all next time